Hello and welcome back to the continuation of the previous tutorial. With awk, you can also sanitize the contents of your output from grep and output clean uh, results. In our case, the IP addresses. So, what we'll do, just say less and scan and less and scan. We send this to grep. What are we grepping over here? As you can see, I hope you will see the contents of our scum so much anyway. So we are going to grep empty or blank spaces. Okay. So with let's start with the uh, Okay, let's take all data that has up. So the criteria here is up. As you can see, we have the IP addresses of the computers that are up. Then we can take that output and pipe it to awk. With awk, we're going to use tag f. Tag f allows you to use that criteria which criteria you, you want to use to filter the content of our output from grab so i'm gonna use the blank spaces so quote then blank if i hit enter nothing will appear over there so that is good because we just picking the contents the spaces okay then this one we're going to direct it here grep as an option to print so what are we going to print we have this the first column over here with the host then this is the second column so we are gonna print the contents of the second column okay just type print dollar sign two okay if we hit enter over there now we have clean list of ip addresses the same thing could be achieved by doing more or less the same work as uh, the first one. So we can just take these. Copy the whole of these. Let's make clear the screen again. So in our scan, this is what we had, okay? So if this is what you want, you can take the output from Nmap, we pipe it to our grip, then this we output it to our file and scan, okay? let's say n scan 2 hit enter so the result that we'll have out of this scanning and as i've shown you the scanning actually eyes our device so you can see over here it is cisco systems and the mark was already changed the source ip is my mobile phone which is in the network so one ten here this computer actually appears as one so the traffic from that device is not increasing at all but i am spoofing the ip address of this other device down here which is my mobile phone and the traffic appears to be coming from here to my target pc so i'm saying they can't be caught here okay let's see our output so if I do less and scan to see the content, we have clear list of IP addresses. So we can continue with uh, our scanning. We want to enumerate, see what we have as output. So what I'm gonna do here, 
is a simple scan so with nmap you can um, scan your network for the kind of operating system that the devices which of course we have the IP addresses uh, are using so there is the TAC I I L then we have our list of IP and scan 2 then we need to show what output we want we want OS that is operating system scan or we can just take tag A hit enter so the same traffic is coming from this machine with a spoofed IP addresses address sorry so if you wanted I could just take the MAC address of either one of these or this one use it to scan the network so I'm having issues here errors so I have my end scan too in here I will edit let's say I don't want I want to scan this just the two then I go back to here now let's see what we have yeah, so the traffic appears to be coming from a Cisco system and uh, we'll see what nmap gives us after this scan let me get rid of this just do a scan see the traffic appears to be coming from specific IP address over here and this is my spoon mark address which is different of course so I've done a scan this is a new scan and as you can see we have this device here 16801 and uh, yeah as you can see also the port 2280 and 1900 are open and the services running over there we have SSH and, and we also have another device here which from the result indicates that all ports are filtered that is my machine on this other end which is a Windows seven machine of course if i go into the file again you can remove remove this ip address we just left with single ip do the same scan for our device and see what 
results we are getting out of there. So it's saying all ports are filtered. Let me just do a spoof of IP address and do the same scan. of course now we have good results here the IP is 12 and as you can see the machine from the predictions here is Windows 28 7 or phone stroke of visitor so either of these and of course it is correct our machine is Windows 7 or as detail is this Windows 7 professional cool our scan work and we have clean results with a spoofed mac address in ip you can of course get to scan a network and hide yourself from mm, those administrators who are not that keen to protect their systems from inadvertent scams by people like us okay thank you for watching my video tutorials and feel free to subscribe to my channel see you in the next tutorial